Hey guys, Run with Craft Scissors here um, with another plan with me. This one is part of the Plan with Me Design Group collab, which means I'll link all of the channels below that are in this group. Um, I think there's like 40 of us, so pick and choose. <laughs> we don't expect you to watch 40 Plan with Me's a week, let alone, you know, the like four that I do, I think. Um, so they'll all be below. We all plan in different planners, um, usually with different kits, which this week will be. Um, occasionally we match, just like it kind of happens <laughs> with that many planner girls. Okay, so um, I was really mixed on the washi that I chose to go with this kit, so that's something I'm going to kind of decide as I go, and you guys will help me, <laughs> even though you can't hear you. Um, these are the new releases in my shop this week. Half of them have already sold out, so if you want them, hurry up and get them. This is limited quantities because I don't have any more of that paper. Um, so there was only 12 listed, and I think four are gone something like that. Um, and then this one, I think I made 13 or 14 and I'm pretty sure like five are gone. So, um, get those <laughs> if you want them because <laughs> they're going fast. This is the Halloween freebie I'm going to be doing, um, with every order. So it's just a plaid. I always melt the end so that it stays, um, good for a long time. I've actually had people tag me in pictures from like ribbon clips that I did over two years ago. So it's kind of funny to see that. And then I always put a little dab of hot glue so that it stays secure on the clip and it doesn't like, that doesn't come loose. So anyway, good quality stuff. <laughs> All right, um, the clips that I want to use with this kit, I think, are this uh, maple leaf. I think it brings out the maroon. I know my nails match again. I kind of figured that would happen with fall spreads. And then I picked this golden fox just because there's like golden yellows. There's two different yellows in this spread. Um, so I think that'll look cute. And there's gold in this spread. I don't know if you guys can see there's gold there. So those are what I chose. Um, I always think of New York in the fall, and now looking back, I totally should have done this for the week of 9-11, um, but for some reason, when I slid it into my planner, I didn't really think about it. So sorry, um, but next time, next time I'm going to try to plan a New York spread for that week. I always think of New York in the fall just because of the Thanksgiving parades, and like, I don't know, I just think of New York in the fall. I don't know why. <laughs> so this kit is from Pomegranate Sticker Co. It is glossy paper, but it isn't like that squeaky glossy paper. I don't know how else to describe it. Um, but you definitely should check out her shop. Um, there's a discount code below. I think it's 25% off. Um, it's either 20 or 25, so check that out. So this is the kit. You guys wanna see everything. I did a haul, there's the... Um, date covers and washi and the headers. Okay, so I usually do this and this, and then this is usually last, but this also has full boxes on it. And then this has the half boxes and checklists. Um, half boxes are last. Then I do full boxes, full box checklist. There's some more full boxes. Okay, so I think I'm all organized. The washi that I am considering um, I just bought this one from Joann's last weekend. Um, I think that the teal, okay, let's go ahead and open it. The teal on the fox really goes, and then the color, did I cut it at all? <laughs> the color of the fox, and then the gold on its forehead, I think really go. So, I've never had one of these before. There's like a paper a sticker. I've never bought Joanne's washi before. Oh, it's kind of glossy. Is there another seal around it? There's another seal around it. Or is it not? It's not? It's just like that? Okay, so this is kind of glossy too. That's interesting. Okay, so this one has like flowers, which this kit has flowers if you saw it. I don't know if you saw it. Yeah, see the flowers in the background? And then I think that goes really well, like that, those two blues match. So I was thinking about this one. I really thought there was like another sealant on there with how glossy it was. Now this one, I'm not sure because it's got multiple colors on it. And I think there's like a dark green. So I'm not sure I'll use the coordinating, the washi that coordinates with the fox. Well, yeah, because that lime green and dark green are just going, no, you don't belong here. I don't know. I don't know. So probably not that one, but maybe the fox one. And then I pulled two fall washies of the 
leaves because I think the different colored leaves go, but then there's that dark green on there, so then I'm like, eh, I don't know. And then I thought this might be the same teal as well, but I know that these are not the same. This one's a bit darker and this one's lighter, but this one had rose gold in it, and you know how I like that, and this has gold gold. So then I wasn't sure. And then I had this New York City washi, but it's like a skyline, but it's dark. It's like a nighttime skyline. So I wasn't sure if I should use that. I don't know you guys and then I had this this one I feel like really goes so I was thinking this one and this one and then maybe one of these or should I go ahead and use the New York skyline just because it's a New York spread so it doesn't matter I can't decide because I feel like that's just so dark like it's nighttime I don't know I don't know okay we'll see what I need you can see my struggle here. But I'm really leaning towards the plaid and the fox, that's for sure. All right, so let's get started because I've been talking about washi way too much and you guys are like, just do it. <laughs> okay, so my to-do goes at the top. And this is an Erin Condren kit. That's why I need all the washi because that's how I make Erin Condren kits work in my Happy Planner. And this is a classic Happy Planner in case you're like, what kind of Happy Planner? Because there are so many different kinds. Because um, the big one... I've never had and I probably won't ever because the boxes are just like intimidatingly large in my opinion. Um, I'm like, okay, how would I possibly make this work because the height and width of Erin Condren stickers do not fit in there. But I have seen, see then I talk about her, Simply Shelly, Simply Shelly with an I on both words. Um, she plans with Erin Condren stickers in her big happy planner all the time and it looks fantastic because she does this whole like layering effect thing but if you want more structure like me where it's like it goes straight up and down it covers all the headers blah -de blah -de blah what are you doing stick the sticker down um, then that won't work for you so I don't know I'm excited I only have one planner left to purchase for the next year and that's the Erin Condren and I'm waiting for the Black Friday sale I feel like some people are, some people aren't. Some people are going ahead and buying it. <laughs> and I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> like, Black Friday sale. And then I'm like, oh yeah. And other shops are already start talking about their Black Friday sales. And I'm like, oh yeah, I guess I should think about that. <laughs> like, I need to have a Black Friday sale too. Which I remember, I think I did last year. And I really didn't sell that many. So I don't know. But things have really changed this year. So it may happen. Oh, do you guys see what's on my arm? Do you see that? Yeah. <laughs> I went and got a henna tattoo. <laughs> um, I remember I told you guys I was going to go to Saturdays if you watched my last plan with me. If you didn't, that's okay. Um, I went to like our fall festival that's here in my town. And um, I've been considering getting a tattoo, but I have like have commitment issues on like what to get. So that's my thing. And so I have been considering getting my logo. I know that sounds crazy, but... I'm also crafty in other aspects of my life, so even if for some reason I'm no longer run with craft scissors, I'm still crafty. Like, that's always going to be a part of me. I've been a crafty kid since little, little kid. I had a car, one of those card tables in the garage and with my glitter and my hot glue gun and, yeah, popsicle sticks. <laughs> the early works of run with craft scissors. <laughs> um, I made a lot of coasters. They were very popular. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> so anyway, so you want to see the rest of the tattoo. Um, I think she did a pretty good job because she basically just had to go based off the drawing and it wasn't like she had a lot of time with it to like sketch it out herself or anything. I just said, hey, can you draw this? And she's like, I can take a whack at it. She's like, do you care if I mess it up? And I was like, nope. <laughs> so um, there's obviously some aspects where it's a little off, but I don't really care. You get what it is, especially if you know my logo. So there you go. She did add some glitter, so that's on there, but it's henna, so it'll come off in a couple weeks. But my original plan was to do it really small right here, and she's like, I think right here. I was like, okay. So there it is. That's my Run With Craft Scissors logo on my arm. So we'll see if that's where I decide I want it, but it was still fun to do. I haven't gotten henna in like two years. The last time I got henna was because my finger broke, and I couldn't wear my wedding ring because my hand was all swollen, and so I got... A henna tattoo of a wedding ring. It was the 
the infinity symbol with the word love in it. It's pretty common in like tattoo world. Anyway, I don't have any tattoos, but my students always like, they think I'm lying. They think I have a couple. And I'm like, no, I don't. I'm like, why do you guys think that? Why do you think I have multiple? Like, they're like, we always thought you had a couple. I don't know. So, I mean, my brother has a few. And my sister-in-law has a few. My husband doesn't. It's not like we're against it. We just have never done it or spent the money on it. I don't know. Because some tattoos are expensive. Some are cheap. You can. It depends on where you get it done at and how much is it. Like what size, I guess. I don't know. I have no idea. I've never even gone with someone to get a tattoo. I almost did. And then it was like in the shady part of town. And I was like, yeah, I'm not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Not happening. So I skipped out on that. Someone else did go with her and just ditch her, but <laughs> that would be wrong. <laughs> I think a guy ended up going with her, so. Or no, a girl that knew the guy that she was getting it from. That's what it was. I remember now. That was a long time ago. It's hard to remember stuff sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes. I remember a lot of stuff. You guys actually laugh at me because I remember too much. I don't feel like I'm about to sneeze. Mm. And if you hear a noise, that humming, that's my air conditioner. It's hot. I'm not going to turn it off. Okay, there's some littles. I'll probably use these on my dinner menu, which if I remember, then I don't need washi up here. I can use this. The half box as like a box for my other menu items or my deco sticker that usually has a picture of what I write right here. Anyway, I just think it's cute. And then I'm going to use the wide washi she includes down here. I think so. And then I have to figure out what I'm going to do with the date covers because I need washi up there to use them. Okay, and then I use these on the sidebar, so I'll come back to those. Okay, so date covers. Let's see. What washi goes really well with the date covers? I thought about doing the New York City skyline up there. Because it's really wide and dark. And then I can cut off some of the night sky. Oh, but then that might cut off some of the buildings. It's not as dark as I thought it was. Like, rolling it out. It's actually really pretty. Okay, but like, if I do that, then it'll cover up some of the bottom of the buildings. It'll cover up a lot of the bottom of the buildings. Yeah, I don't want to put that there. But I still might use this in my spread. I'm just not going to put it there. Um, it's got flowers, so I don't want to put foxes with it. I guess that's where I'm going to use this. So I need my white out. Okay. Oh, come on. I wasn't pushing hard enough. Oh. Okay. You usually only need to cover the top half, and then you should be good. As far as that goes. This is my Dollar Tree washi. Yeah, yeah. I actually have Tombow washi at work, but my work pays for that. <laughs> and it's not in like a vast supply. <laughs> Where it's like, oh, this is the same as taking a paper clip. <laughs> it's not the same. <laughs> I had to like order it for my classroom. We get a classroom budget. It's kind of weird. I don't really want to talk about that. It's not big enough ever. So <laughs> that's why I don't want to talk about it. Um, what have I got going on this week? Um, I'm going to be out of my classroom possibly two half days. I think it's Wednesday and Thursday. I'm not super excited about that. Um, but I'm kind of going on Wednesday and then if I feel like I understand it and everything and I don't really need to go on Thursday, then I won't go. So I'll have to, but then I feel bad because the sub already thinks they have a job and it's like, I put it in just in case. <laughs> So, but they kind of have to get used to that. Substitutes are like temporary teachers and they work for a temp agency, so they can just find another job. It's just they think they have one right now and they might not, and I feel bad about that because I've been there. I subbed for three years. And then I, I hated it when I subbed for a coach and their game got like canceled and so they had to cancel it on me last minute in the morning. Oh, it made me so mad. 
So I was like, oh, I don't have time to find another job. Like, then I have to take a last minute one. Who knows if the teacher has her lesson plans done? <laughs> so I didn't particularly care for that. Um, I've never gone to New York, so I don't have like New York stories to talk about. I want to go, and I want to go for Thanksgiving because I want to go still go see the um, the parade, which is probably the most annoying thing about living in New York. I don't know. I'm just kind of guessing. But I, I've always wanted to go. My mom went to New York this last uh, summer, or was it this school year? No, it was summer. Cause, yeah, because she got me um, New York City m and pajama pants. So, <laughs> um, it's just funny because our whole family likes m and um, So I'm sure you're like, she did what? <laughs> and then I think she went to a couple of plays. I don't know. We haven't really had time to like sit and talk. Like, there's usually a four-year-old in the way, like my, my kid. <laughs> so, like, we barely get out what happened this week. And then it's like, okay, he's cranking out. Time to go. Like, whatever it is. So, there. Yeah, that looks pretty together. I need to trim the top of that one real quick. It's hanging over. But this one didn't. I don't know. Am I crooked? Am I lining it up funny? I have no idea. Washi is not being very cooperative and getting cut off, but whatever. It's from a paper pack. I got it from Peachy Cheap. And it's actually a paper scrapbooking brand. I don't remember which one. It may be American Crafts or something. But it matched like a kit of papers. Anyhow. Alright, let's get started on more washi because my full boxes will not fit without it. Um, theme sticker, theme sticker. Is it going to be Fifth Avenue or Statue of Liberty? I think it's going to be Statue of Liberty. Yeah. I think that'll be good. So we'll stick that over here. Okay. I have been flipping this over. I've been liking doing this. I flip this over and then I line it up with the bottom of this. There's no gap. Is that straight? Yeah. I think so. Just trying to see here. It seems a little crooked, but whatever. I'm always a little crooked. I have scoliosis. I just blame it on that. Okay. Why is my phone on vibrate? That's so annoying. Especially since I get like a bunch of notifications. No. Oh. Okay. Um I think we'll try okay, these are pattern boxes, so I don't want to use this. This needs to go down here with the non-pattern boxes that are just like glitter and kind of a faint pattern of New York City behind it. I think this one needs to go down here. And then, so then I really don't want to use this one up here. I need to use a different one. But I don't really want to use this because I just use that up there and it'll be right there and that's too much of that. Don't you think? Or should I just use this one and like suffer with the weird greens that are in it? Okay, there's like one, two, three out of the five colors that like match it. Do we really think the green is going to stick out that much? I don't think it will. I think it'll be okay. And I'm just overreacting. That never happens. Okay, I'm going to go with this one and see how I feel. If I hate it, there's a chance I may change it or cover it up. Which I think it's funny how often like that happens to me that I like put down washi. It always happens in this box. And then I realize I didn't need to and I end up covering it up. I'm like, sorry I wasted washi. Sorry. These rolls are, um, these go together. They're at Joann's. I've never, I went there because of the Planner Society. She hauled in her story that they had some really cute fall washi and they're $2 stuff. And I was like, uh, yeah, I need that in my life. It's so pretty. It's got foil gold on it and everything. Kind of like this one. And it was like wide and it was pretty and I wanted it. So I went and they didn't have it. They only had this one and like a happy birthday one. I think one other one. I'm not even sure what was on it. And then, that's weird. These feel totally different. <laughs> but they're in the same pack together. But they usually come in pairs. But I think these ones, because they're wide, are individual. 
the ones that I'm talking about from her Insta story, which other people have been sharing it too. I hardly ever go to Joann's. The only like washi that's really at our Joann's is like the little bee or something like that, I think is what it's called. And I have not really been impressed with that brand of washi. Usually it doesn't stick very well for me. I like this one. Okay. And then I'm going to put the washi, this washi at the bottom. I need to cut some of it off so I need my scissors back. Probably this pen. Not sure yet. Okay, so should I cut off the taxi cab or the Statue of Liberty? I'm going with the taxi cab. Okay, I need my pen for this because there's not something right there that I can use. Okay. I just clicked it again and again. I don't even know why. Right on it. There. Sometimes I just wing it, but I don't feel like it today. Then I'm guessing that's the Brooklyn Bridge? I'm not really sure. I grew up in the Bay Area. I don't know what you guys want from me. <laughs> so if you've ever been to New York, tell me what you did there. Because I would love to know what is actually fun to do there because I've never been. Why didn't I put the dates down yet? What's wrong with me? I don't know. Okay, now I want to cut off a little bit from each side on this one because there's a little bit of room for each side to be cut off. Okay, right there and right there. Okay, I need to cut off where her dress is from here. And then on this side, one of the bridge lines. Yeah, the middle one. Wrapper. There. Sorry. It's the washi wrapper from earlier. I wanted to make another appearance. I just got so excited to be in my video. Oh wow, I need to stop with that humor. <laughs> oh, sticker. <laughs> Alright, so that's done. Let's do the date cover, shall we? What day are we doing? The 18th, that's right. And I still don't know where my tweezers are, so whatever. I'm going to use my fingernails. Alright, 18, 19, 20. But I thought, I was actually thinking this has fall colors, but it's not quite a, like a fall kit. If that makes sense. So I thought it's good for one of my in-betweens where it's like, because technically, well, actually I think the first day of fall is Friday. So from then on, it should be pretty much fall spreads. Except for when I do my dad's Star Wars spread for his birthday. That one is not fall themed. And then I think there's a, like a me time spread or whatever for my mom's birthday. It's all girly and stuff like, I don't know. I just picked it for that. There's some deco on here, we'll add that later. And then, uh, Weekend Banner I'm not doing yet. We'll do those later. And then I have an extra, okay, so let's go ahead and do our boxes. I'm doing this all sorts of different <laughs> than I usually do. Like I'm planning differently, like usually, I don't know if I, I don't know. I just feel like I'm planning differently. Like the order that I'm doing things is different. There. Okay, that looks cute. I don't mind the dark green. I've decided. I've decided it's okay. <laughs> I'm so weird. <laughs> um, so I went to Saturdays today and we got my son a tie-dye shirt. I bought some of those like uh, wax melts because a uh, lady, um, it's called Shelly's Smellies, which is really funny, right? And so I had to get those. Um, I got Amber Romance and Caramel Apple as my scents. My melter thing is in my kitchen, so it's just kind of there. Because uh, like my entry to my house goes to my kitchen, but if you go around the door, then you're in my living room. It's weird. Anyway, so... I got that and then 
we ate at a Peruvian um, food truck, which is good. Um, that's not weird food for me. I guess I should explain. <laughs> My sister-in-law is Peruvian. Hey, Sandy. She watches. Um, and then... Like, my, one of my best friends in California was Puerto Rican, so she had stuff like this, and then I've had a student that was um, Puerto Rican and Italian, and her mom used to make me empanadas, so yeah, I have had them before. It was, a, it was like empanadas and tamales, and then I didn't know what the dessert was called. It started with a B. I don't remember what it was called off the top of my head now, but we didn't get the dessert. Um, but it was good. I got the beef potato and cheese and pinata that my mom got. She ordered a pork tamale, but it came out chicken. We're not really sure how that happened. Poor, poor pig. <laughs> I don't know. Um, so there's extra washi strips and then some quarter boxes on this sheet. So we might come back to that later. Don't know yet. All right, let's do this one. The full box checklist. And then she also has this one, which I'm wondering if it was supposed to be glitter for Monday. I'm guessing not. I wonder if she said no to that. <laughs> I don't care. But I just thought it was funny. <laughs> okay. So this kind of, she already has it lined up as like color blocking. Yeah, she does, because this is the yellow gold, and then this is the maroon glitter. And this is the golden, golden yellow. That's cool how she did that. I'm color blocking, guys. <laughs> I'm so corny. Oh, it's covering up the foxes. Oh, that's sad. I didn't think about that. I wanted to cover up the foxes. Now yeah, you guys are like, what is she doing? doesn't know, but she kind of wants to just put the washi over the bottom. I was trying to see how far it would come up. That makes me sad. Can you still tell they're foxes without their ears? Like, you can't even see their ears. I don't like it. But now I'm like, okay, do I want to cover up the last box in this checklist? I don't think it matters if I do, so... And I caught it before I did the other side. I wonder how well this washi comes up, because it's like so plasticky feeling. Let's see if the washi comes up. Because the stickers are doing just fine. They are A-OK. -okay. Yep. Yeah, it's not tearing my paper at all. All right, be patient with me, guys, or skip ahead, whichever. <laughs> Putting those down. And then I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna put it right back on top. So I'm not wasting washi. Look at that, the washi was already measured for me and everything. <laughs> no, it wasn't. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take this one off before I put the boxes down. This could be a problem if you put your washi down first. Or you don't think about how like the box is going to come down. Okay, there is a film over this because I just peeled up some of the film on this washing. There we go. Okay. Alright, let's take that down so it doesn't roll. And then start putting okay, so nothing ever happened. We're all good. Um, there was a carved out pumpkins at this thing and there was one in like a bottle or jar of water and like bubbles were coming out of its mouth and the carving it was cool so I took a picture of that and then there was a horse made out of hay so that was cool um, there was like full face painting for the kids um, there was like a little um, I don't know, it was like a playpen for kids, which was weird, but it was like made out of barn fence. I'm not really sure. And then there was this um, wood, like, deco art place. You know what I'm talking about, where it's like, just like, oh, like, old wood fence stuff and they paint it. I don't know how to describe it. Anyway, usually that stuff is like super expensive, but the lady that was there this year, like, her stuff was like really cheap. 
and she was doing personalization for free and everything so my mom got one she didn't get it personalized she, it was just a wooden candy cane but she really liked the owl one which I tried to talk her into that one because I was like fall lasts longer than Christmas so you get more of your money but I think the candy one candy cane one was cheaper so that kind of won us over all right so this will go on my sidebar this will probably not go in my sidebar. No, it will. This is my to buy, and then this will be the meal practice meal planning, rough draft of my meal plans. Okay, and then we need this. Okay, there's these full box, these half boxes are a little bit smaller than regular half boxes, so that's why I'm definitely going to need the washi because I don't think I need it. Oh no, I don't need it. I don't need washi because remember, I told you I was going to forget. Remember? I was going to put these down. Yeah, yeah. I remember now. Look at me remembering stuff. Okay. So I need the yellow yellow over here. So I'm going to put it all the way down to the bottom of this washi. Oh, that's perfect. Okay. And then I need the deco maroon one. Which I'm doing this upside down. I just realized it doesn't matter on that one, but it does on this one. Upside down Empire State Building. That would be awful. Okay, and then I need a regular golden one. So I'm doing pattern solid, pattern solid, anyway. But also color blocking at the same time, because I'm talented. <laughs> I'm being sarcastic. <laughs> okay. That took extra time. I'm not happy about that, but whatever. All right, and then we'll do the yellow. Oh, oh no. My plan is ruined. Cause that is gonna be the maroon and then this will be the gold pattern. So there's gonna be two that are like that. Oh well, right next to each other. I should have gone with the teal non pattern box, but whatever. I don't really care that much. <laughs> I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> My pattern failed me. Just a little. Okay, and then there's checklist, which I won't use, and then there's little flags, which I probably won't use. Like, there's a good chance that I won't use it. These are kind of nice, though. Quarter boxes again. And another extra half box, which I usually use this. Nope. No, on this one I just put a hat. I just put a habit tracker. Okay, so I'm gonna grab these, and they're gonna go at the top of every box, so that it looks nice all the way across. Cause I am in a white space planner, as you can tell. I just ignore these flowers down here. By the way, they don't exist. They just don't. <laughs> they never match but I picked this planner because it was the most neutral one they had because at least it didn't have the watercolor that was coming out the sides on the weekend that drove me nuts when I found out there were planners that didn't have that I was like I need that in my life because I complained about it all the time like everything matches except for this watercolor coming out the side saying hello okay yellow Drive me nuts. Okay, what else? What are we gonna have this week? So I didn't meal plan before this plan to me. Last week I did. This week I didn't. I have no idea what we're having. There was something I wanted to try. Was it spaghetti? No. Oh, no, I have meatballs up in my freezer, so I thought we should do spaghetti and meatballs. Because I like to look at what I have and meal plan off of that, and then if there's if I run out of ideas based on that stuff, then I come up with something new. That's how I meal plan. I think it's efficient in that aspect. And there was extra pizza sauce in there, but somehow it disappeared and I'm not really sure what happened. But I also know we don't want to do spaghetti and meatballs recently because we ordered pizza tonight. <laughs> I need a drink. That's what's next. Okay, so my to buy goes at the top. There's the yellow. So that's gonna go here. Do I usually put washi? No. Just checking. Just checking. I have like last week spread like the this side 
Um, what are you doing? <laughs> like wrinkled. <laughs> so I was trying to put it down. Like, do not be difficult right now. I've already had issues. <laughs> yeah, silly sticker. Um, what else? What else was that the thing? I bought those crocheted at the top hand towels. I love those things. I my kitchen has handles on the drawers, and I like to put it. At least one in there, because usually there's one on the um, the oven, but usually it falls off at some point. So you know. All right, where's her washi? There we go. Thought maybe we could use this stuff instead of mine, because then I don't have to try to force other ones in there. But I'm still sad I didn't get to use this one, because then I realized I liked it. So maybe I should just put a chunk of the skyline right there. It's really wide. It's too wide. What are you thinking? Don't do that. Okay, I'm going to put the floral one. With floral washi. It's got that nice gold and yellow in it. Okay, and then my next one is meal planning. So I'll use the dinner sticker. I could use this week, but I'm going to use dinner because it's meals. It's dinner meals. And it's kind of what I a rough draft of what I have planned. I usually just use it as a list. It has a Monday through Sunday, which makes me think, yeah, that's my meal planning one. But I actually don't eat this stuff on like the days. I just cross it out as we go. <laughs> so I'm like, okay, what do I left to make this week? And usually it's like the thing I didn't want to make. Which I think we still have breakfast for dinner. I didn't do that because I don't like making pancakes. But I think we talked about this in the other plan with me, so I don't want to go into it again. <laughs> And I'm sniffling. Ah, so annoying. All right. More washi. Yes, yes. I'm going to actually put two strips down. Because the only thing I have left to put over here is my habit tracker. So why not? Oh, I should just finish it out and put all three. Don't you guys think so? Yep, and she doesn't put cut lines in between, so the image matches up to look like a little half box thing here. If you do it straight enough. Oh, it's kind of crooked. How did that happen? I don't even know. That's not crooked. That has to stay there. I'll fix it with a header or something. Of course, we have a tracker. Um, you're over here. Okay. I have a checker. Maybe I can fix it with you. If I can line you up with that. There. Fixed it. Now you can't tell it's crooked. <laughs> you just know because you were here. <laughs> okay, and then I don't need anything else at the bottom. That's what I was thinking. There's today to buy to do um don't need those there oh here's another little oh those are flags I was like what is that um I don't know I was trying to think of something to put there I got nothing except for more washi I guess I could I feel like I just want to stick it down all at once. I don't think it'll let me do that. Will you let me just stick you all at the same time? Can I do that? That would be awesome. Roll more. There. See, it's starting to fan out is the problem. I need it to lay flat. Ooh. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. I have to do it piece by piece. Without taking too much time. That'd be cool if I could do that though. <laughs> but I can't. Um what else? I was trying to think what else was at this thing. There was old cars and there was new cars. There was old cars on one side of the thing and then new cars on the other side. Um the first, like, we 
it opened at 9 and we were there at like 11 ish something like that and the first place we stopped at we realized my mom forgot her water in the car so we need to stop and get a drink and I was like okay well I'll carry on a soda with me they were out of water and soda all they had was like Sprite and Coke Zero they were out of my Coke and she didn't have Dr. Pepper either I was like why are you even open <laughs> but whatever <laughs> Okay, so I ended up using two boxes of washi. That's actually probably a record for me. Just saying. All right. We can banner. I need that. And then we'll go through her functionals. I'm thinking I should do my weather first. I don't know. I'm not sure. I don't want to cover up my, like, washi that I worked so hard to have. But I also don't want to cover that up. I need room there. Here, we'll put it right here. And then I'll just have not a lot of things to clean on the weekend. <laughs> so you can still see the majority of my foxes. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I'm not doing anything this weekend. I'm not cleaning anything this weekend because there's no room for it in my planner. <laughs> like that's going to work. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I don't need... I'm not going to need this anymore. I used up all the boxes and then... I don't really use those in this planner like that. I'm done with this one. And done with this one. And I'm done with this one, I believe. Yeah, might use those throughout the week, but we'll see. All that we have left is functionals and some deco, I think. So let's see, payday is Friday. Hope you get paid every Friday. And then, um, let's see. Plan with me and this planner happens on Saturday nights. And then trash day is Wednesday. And then, well, it's, Wednesday, it's Thursday, but I put it out there. Lazy day, don't know what that's like. Dishes, coffee, Nail polish, date night, cleaning day. Not sure when those are going to happen. Laundry. I definitely need to deal with that. There's laundry day and then there's a basket. I'm going to put the basket because I'm going to need to fold stuff, I think. And then there's spread pick. There's a camera right here, so we'll use that on Wednesday. Cover up the gap. And then I think that's the only camera that she has, so I need to dig out another one. And, um, oh, she does have a little medicine circle so I can put that on the medicine tracker um, there's a bed I like that one for like changing sheets or something so maybe I'll try to do that this week probably on Wednesday change the sheets and then haircut no car makeup airplane grocery store usually happens Saturday or Sunday lately it's been Sundays um, no doctor don't know when bath night's gonna be for kiddo it'll be Sunday so usually like by Wednesday Thursday at the latest he needs another one gas I know I'm gonna need to get gas but not until probably Tuesday so we'll see yeah those are all we'll sees no bills due there's like a credit card I don't need that okay done with those let's do weather so I decided to do dot icons this week, so I'm trying to stick with all of those. We will see if I am successful. Alright, so Monday is scattered thunderstorms. So I'm trying to use up these, because this was like, I bought this from when I like first started planning you guys, like first started, like two some years ago. Planner cake is still a really big deal. Okay, so thunderstorms, Monday and Tuesday. But I was like, why do I still have these? <laughs> Then Wednesday, it's partly cloudy, so I'll use this one. And then Thursday is scattered thunderstorms. And then Friday, Friday is mostly sunny, mostly sunny. Um, no suns left on this one. I think that's why I pulled this one in. This is from Purple Planner Papery, who I don't PR for anymore, but um blissful life does so you can check out her channel and then mostly sunny saturday sunday 
is partly cloudy. Ugh, I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> ah, I felt like that was a long time coming. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. So that one's done. I just keep right on going. That's kind of how I am. I've been sneezing my whole life. Okay, um, Monday scattered showers, but I don't need that one. Okay, cool. All right, so I used all the icon ones. So we're gonna see if I can start using these up because I was like, I need to use these up. And this is like the perfect time for these because that's when we get a lot of rain and thunderstorms in the fall. Okay, I didn't end up needing the medicine bottle. There's my character sticker, Monday Wednesday Friday, and the glitter box. So my character is this little fox right there. And this is from Jalen Paper Co. Brie K. I think still PRs for her. I should check on that because I say it in like every video because I have the giraffes in one planner and then um, the foxes in another and then I have unicorns from Label with Love Co. in another planner and then I have penguins from Britannia in another planner. So I got it all covered. Okay, so Monday, these are Loretta's. These are Cupcakes and Sticky stickers. So there'll be a discount code below for her. So Monday... She has a little coffee and she's tired. Wednesday, she's excited and she has a little camel. And then Friday, she's like shouting that it's Friday. Yay. Those go in this planner. And then litter box is going to be cleaned. Let's see, I'm going to clean it yesterday. So I need to do Tuesday. Tuesday. Thursday. And Saturday. Ooh. I'm gonna put it over here so I can still write some stuff in. <laughs> I only have two left on this sheet. She has dog stickers too. Cupcakes and Stickies does have dog stickers if you're a dog person. I have a dog too, but I don't really have like maintenance because she's like outdoor only, pretty much. Okay, Deco. There's a cute little purse. We'll put this one over here because it's like to buy. It's kind of funny. We'll put it in this one. And then there's the taxi cab. Um, where are you gonna go? I feel like right here. I was trying to look for a space. And then I know I need something over there because my header didn't match. So I'll put the flowers there. And then I have another Statue of Liberty, which I wanna put here. I think it'll fit best there. And then there's a Fifth Avenue sign, which is cute. There's a Fifth Avenue sign there too, so I should probably put it somewhere else on. Probably. Here, we'll put it over here. Fifth Avenue dinner. <laughs> I don't even know. Okay, so I have leftover dates, which sometimes I'll sneak and use these in my personal planner just to decorate it up. And then I have leftover deco, which we'll use throughout the week probably, when I decide to do stuff. <laughs> There's basically two birthday stickers. There's a present and a balloon. Yeah. We're going to vacuum tomorrow, so I am going to need to vacuum again on Tuesday. Let's put that there. All right. So those are done. I think I have leftovers on like every sheet. Sometimes that happens with kits. Yep, I do. I have leftovers on every kit. On every sheet. Oh well. I just shove it in my planner and I use them before I get out other stickers. So I try to use what matches. Anyway, so let's go ahead and put my little clips. Okay, this one is crooked because that's what, it's mine. That's why. So like, see how it doesn't match up perfectly? Yeah, that doesn't happen when I send out clips. Um, so that one's mine. And then this one, I don't think there's anything wrong with this one. I just wanted it. <laughs> so I made it for myself. <laughs> so there you go. There's my little fox and my maple leaf. And there's my New York spread. So I hope you guys like it. Have a great week. Thanks for watching. Give it a like and please subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Discount codes below as well as other channel links. Bye, guys.